Every generation of parents are challenged as they try to protect their young daughters from sexual content that's out there that could be harmful to them. You, your generation is not exempt from this. There is so much going on. It's a little shocking, actually, at times. Recently, I, I saw a video of a rap song um, that just, I just couldn't believe it. I mean, it was way over the top and certainly not in my mission for helping young girls that I teach to really have a tremendous respect for their body and even have a respect for the process of sexual maturity. Then I saw a video that just came out on Netflix that just, I mean, it was like, I can't believe it. And I'm sure that many of you who have been exposed to all these things are feeling some of the same um, anguish that I'm feeling. The biggest challenge that I see with this is that these girls, 11, 12, 13 years old, their brains are going through a transformation time to help them be able to think more like a young adult than like a child. And so patterns are being set and established to give them that young adult way of looking at the world. It's alarming to me when these young girls are exposed to this kind of content during this big transformation time. There's no way around it. This has always been a problem. But I think the solution is for you as the parent to take the time to sit down and talk about it. Don't just ignore it. That's not going to help because then there's only one voice in the situation and we need your voice to be heard. And it's important how you do that. You teach them along the way about just protecting themselves uh, physically, having a lot of respect for the whole process of reproduction and the reproductive um, functions that are going on in their body as they're maturing through puberty. I just think this is a time to really step up as parents and have some great talks with your daughters. Go If you have to, I mean, get the explicit information out there so that she can understand how you think about it. Always, your opinion is going to be the most important opinion for her, even if she resists you. So please take the time to talk to her and to uh, explain to her what the different perspectives are and where you stand. I'm Dr. M with Anatomy for Kids.